Hey, what's up, YouTube? In this video, I will be showing you guys um, two things: how to fix the error um, DD3 uh, D50 um, for Grand Theft Auto IV for PC. Now, this is on Windows 7. Um, the second thing I'm gonna show you guys how to run it with Windows 7. First thing is first is that you're gonna need to go into your um, personalization. I'm sorry that I'm doing this through my um, cell phone, my BlackBerry. Um, is that I'm on a desktop, so I wouldn't be able to talk. I'll be able to type, and I like to talk. So, um, yeah. So go into personal. Wow, not personalized. Sorry. All right. You're gonna want to need to go into your Grand Theft Auto folder. Uh, C disk. Um, depending on where you save it, it should always be in the C um, local C disk programs and files. All right. Now that you've done that, you're gonna need to go into Rockstar, Rockstar Games, uh, go into the Grand Theft Auto one. Now go, sorry, um, okay, go into the launch GTA I IV, click on it, make sure it's highlighted, and then go into properties, that's right there. There might be a part two of this video, I uh, don't know. Go into compatibility and make sure it's checked. And what you might have, you know, Service Pack 2 on this. So go hit Windows XP Service Pack 3. Um, if there's any chances of that, um, you're gonna have to probably download it for Windows 7, and um, and then you'll see it and you can select it. Now that you've done that, um, there's gonna be a link in the description for the um, shader that you're gonna need. In order for the game to run, which which gives you the error code, but at first you need that you're gonna need a direct X 9.0 C, um, and then you're gonna install that, and then that's what you come into here. But if you already have that, go ahead, and then you'll just skip to this process. Now it's gonna come into the R and R file. You are gonna need Renoir. If you don't already have that, link will also be in the description as well. Now you're also gonna need um, to go into the Swift Shader DX9. Um, SM3 build 3383 folder. Now, what I did at first is you're gonna have two file, uh, not two, I mean, two main folders you're gonna use. You're gonna have the x64 and x86. Now, at first, I just went here and I just copied, I copied it and I put it into the photo folder. Uh, let me show you what I mean. I just went here, I didn't do anything special, I didn't go to like PC or whatever, and I just hit right click and I hit paste. Now, when I tried to launch it, it gave an error such as like you know um uh, i don't know exactly so that means so i was like oh all right so i deleted the 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 paul not paul d3 db9 dot dll and i put on the 60 that i mean the 86 and that worked so your so yours might be a 64 or it might, it might be 86 but i don't know but it all depends so once you have done that you should be able to launch it and you won't get the you won't get the error so you just launch that. Uh, yes. Like I said, I apologize for like you know those lines that are like right there, my fingers right there. Apologize for that. If I was on my laptop, you guys know I do the hypercam and I uh, have the built-in mic on my, on my laptop. So, but I am on a different computer. Um. So yeah. Alright, that window pops up. Now, my Grand Photo does take a long time just to get past this process, just to even load up. So, I'm going to go through that. Now, um, this, I don't think the, the this meets the system requirements. So, uh, it might just shut off or something. But, um, for you guys who meet the system requirements, all you have to do is do this, um, and it should work smoothly. So I'm just gonna wait. Um, my BlackBerry, I can't pause. Only I could pause is I have to stop the video, and make a part two, which I don't really think of doing. But um, yeah, I like to stay. Um, it shouldn't be more than a couple of like at most two more minutes or less. Okay. So, like I said again, I apologize for the quality. I'm not gonna move my mouse around really. Um, I was planning on making a video on how to get what is it called again? How to get uh, 
Mac OS X on thing, but I haven't really troubled around with that. You're gonna need Nvidia, Nvidia, so I might do that to my HP manual laptop, uh, 110 NR or something like that. Um, mine does this stupid crap, but um, hopefully yours won't do this. Hopefully yours just gets straight straight to the game. So. Don't know what's gonna happen here. Could just stay black. Um, but if you're still stay black, uh, maybe deleting the the D3 folder thing, Majiggy, would help. But um, if he doesn't do this, you goes straight to the game. Um, I hope this helped. Uh, I'm just gonna wait it out for about another minute, and then um, hope this video helped. Like I said, um, and that's pretty much it. I will provide all the links in the description. About 45 seconds left to wait. Um, provide all the links in the description. Stuff like that. So, I don't really know what's going on here. I know I said this a billion times, but I'm going to apologize for the crappy quality. If I had like an HD camera, uh, it would be a little bit better, but it will actually be a ton bit better. But, uh, All right, 10 seconds left of my waiting. Well, it's on, the monitor is on, so... Uh, I just hit the, hit this, so I can go back to the home screen. All right, so that's pretty much it. I'm putting all the links in the description, such as the WinWar, the hot file link, and um, the DirectX. I think that's it, but um, if I might put additional, because I remember the last one, if there is a last one, but I hope this video helped. Comment, rate, subscribe to the W990, peace.